So, ahead of the 2023 ELMS season opener, what is ELMS? Well, it's the cars for the Le Mans 24 hours, the biggest race in the world of any sort. But this is the European Championship that supports that. Six four-hour races at five amazing European circuits, starting here at the Circuit de Catalunya in Barcelona uh, with four different classes. Effectively, four races over four hours on the same track at the same time. And we've actually had LMP2 split this year, haven't we? LMP2 did have this subclass, LMP2 Pro-Am. This year, it's all different. LMP2 Pro-Am becomes its own class. 11 cars in that class, seven LMP2s. So 18 of these spectacular cars racing at once. They'll have their own 15 minute qualifying session. The bronze driver, the non-professional driver, will do that qualifying session. So that's a big deal for these guys. Racing on a very quiet track against their peers, then they get to go for a point for qualifying and their own podium and their own automatic invitation to the Le Mans 24 hours. And that does mean that LMP2 is the only class with all pro drivers. You're absolutely right. ELMS has proudly had this pro-am history. LMP2 with the seven top cars in the category now, all pro lineups, none of the FI bronze, non-professional drivers in that class. And when you look up and down that entry list for this year, the names are amazing. Ex-Formula One drivers, world champions, Le Mans winning drivers, factory drivers from around the world. It's going to be epic. It is, and the stakes are high when there, are, there is a spot at Le Mans ready and waiting for the winners and the runners-up. It's five places for Le Mans will go to the champions, and in one case, in LMP2, the runners-up in these classes. It's the automatic invitation they're all looking to win, as well as the title of European Le Mans Series champion. Well, we've got a cracking season ahead, don't we? We do. I can't wait to get into that booth and call these races. It's always the same with the European Le Mans Series, but somehow this season, with these, these cars and these drivers on these circuits, it just feels like it's going to be a little bit more special in 2023.